Hey folks, Rick from Stop and Go Radio here. Um, just thought I would throw up a quick video. I know we have a few fans that are, you know, radio buffs, radio hobbyists, whether it's uh, scanners or shortwave or whatever. So I thought I would, you know, there's a lot of talk of SDR, software defined radio. Um, and I've actually started playing with the new LEC, which is the R820T chipset. Um, so my quote-unquote software-defined radio for years has been an ICOM PCR100. And I absolutely love that radio. But I figured, you know, it's time to play around with something new. So with some leftover Christmas money, <laughs> I bought the new Alex. So that's, it's easy enough to find that controller. But what I wanted to show you was a trick I had after installing SDR Sharp. This was not very well documented, so here's the program up and running. Occasionally, you'll do the pull down on the install and you will not find this right here, this, S, this RTL-SDR slash USB. For myself, it did not show up. The trick is you need to run this right here. Zadig, Z A D I G, whatever it is. <laughs> Run it as the administrator. Very simple to do. Come down. See, you'll notice the device is not listed. So, what you have to do is come to Options, List All Devices. Then, do your pull down. You're looking for the Bulk In Interface 0. Make sure that it's Win USB. In some cases, it will actually show the Realtek R820T chipset. If it does not default to WinUSB, run through the install driver. Install this driver anyways. Once that completes, you can go ahead and close that and then run SDR Sharp as per the norm. Once it fires up, your controller will now show up. Very simple. Wait on that to update. And it's actually changed. And there's one of our local stations. <laughs> I will stop that before YouTube pops me for playing music. Um, another little foible I want, uh, notice the FM stereo button is not on by default. So if you're just going to listen to local radio, you may want stereo. Uh, I think that's it for this time around. I'm sure I'll have... Some more updates as I play with this thing. Um, so, yeah, stay tuned, folks. Bye-bye.